So Liz, yes, you're the director. Kelly. You're the first one to speak on this video. What do you have to say about today? The sun is out and we are ready. It's going to be a magnificent race. We're so excited. This okay. is our first race in two, three years wow. because of COVID. So. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're Very good. Yeah. Thanks. You're the second voice on this video. You're busy, but what do you have to say, Ron? Um, it's a beautiful, amazing day. I mean, it can't be bluer of a sky. Um, and we're just really excited to see how we can pull it off yet again. We had two years that we haven't done it, and we're just like relearning everything, as we always do every time when we do this. It's always like, oh, yeah, how did we do that last year? So here we are again. That's what's exciting about it. And how is it successful? So we're happy. since the inception since uh, 1993 this is uh, 29 years ago we started the race here in Philadelphia and uh, we've only missed two years because of the pandemic but we're so happy that we have a beautiful sunny day today to run the race thanks thank you Get raffle tickets, raffle, man. Two, two Phillies tickets and a nice camera. Good looking car. Uh, I'm assuming your son or daughter or somebody did it. This is my granddaughter. Granddaughter, okay. Yeah. 
Very nice. What school are you from? Masterman. What's the pet? Masterman. JR. Masterman. <laughs> Great. Thank you. Yeah, and sustainability is in Hey, that's better. And welcome to the 2022 Solar Sprint. We are going to start racing in, I'd say, another 10 minutes. So before we race, I just want to go make a few basic logistic announcements. Board of technical merit. And I don't think Hello. Hey guys, you guys, you need a, a race. Um, right. They will um, assess your car and you'll learn more about your car. Um, you will discover the troubleshooting table. If you have any problems with your car at any time, the HRC, the engineering department is absolutely phenomenal. And they have been so amazing. Not only do they support us with venue, which couldn't be better, but the, the students are amazing. The engineering students are absolutely wonderful. And they help us train teachers. They do all kinds of things. So we're really looking forward to strengthening and broadening our relationship with Drexel. I'd, I'd like to also thank our board members for coming. We've got a bunch of board members here today who are volunteering. And I'd really love to thank the board. Of Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Jason Baxter. I'm a professor of chemical engineering here at Drexel. And it's a pleasure to have everyone here. So we're super excited to be able to host this outside again, and it's a beautiful day. So I also would like to, to thank the Philadelphia Solar Energy Association for partnering with this awesome event. Uh, and I would also like to acknowledge our College of Engineering for providing financial support uh, to help us run this event, as well as student volunteers. So I hope during your time here, uh, if you've got a little bit of free time, uh, we do have our Society of Women Engineers is uh, over just in front. Funders supporting us, one of whom is here today that I'd like to introduce. And I have to admit that without their support, I'm not sure that we could have brought this race back. So this is the Pennsylvania Department of Environmental Protection. And I'd love to introduce Pat Patterson to you, who is the regional director for this region. All right, thank you so much, uh, Liz, and it's a distinct pleasure and honor to be here, and like uh, Liz said, you got a Chamber of Commerce Day for a great event. The last thing you want is uh, some bureaucrat making a long speech to, uh, to gum up the vibe for the morning, so I'll be very brief and say, uh, again, what a pleasure it is for the Department of Environmental Protection and Sec on behalf of Secretary Patrick McDonald for me to be here to help kick off this event. Uh, as Liz said, she's being uh, very generous. The department does uh, lend some money to this event over the years. I believe this is uh, their 29th year in business in, in doing this particular event, but uh, we're really so proud that it uh, brings to the forefront the, the students in the region that, uh, that participate in this event um, and get to exercise their creativity and their ingenuity in uh, developing these uh, these cars and hopefully fun events like this. Volunteer, Bob Nape. So I'm going to ask Lisa Rose, who's president of our board, just to say a few words about Bob. Thanks, Liz. Um, 29 years ago, a small group of volunteers had the ambitious idea to start this program. And we're very, very grateful to all the volunteers who have participated for the last 29 years. Uh, Bob was a light in this whole program, and he had an uh, infectious smile, a generous spirit, and was really terrific. Unfortunately, we lost him last year, but this race is dedicated to him. And if he had anything to do with this glorious solar day, we want to thank him. So thank you all. And, and one last thing, if anybody has not received a race assignment, please report to the table. Please visit Pazagen. They're an absolutely wonderful firm that's pretty new to Philly, but they're doing a fantastic solar program of solar leasing. And as far as I know, I think they guarantee savings. 
on your bill. So it's a wonderful, wonderful outfit. We will also have an electric vehicle that'll be parked at the top of this uh, on Market Street. Get to work. Now that's a good thing to say on camera. What did you say? You're going to find your table and get to work. <laughs> Racer. Well, welcome. Even though I'm allergic to work. Racers in race two. Yeah, well, We're talking cars that number could four, be so. 13, 21, 23. Racers, another reminder for you. All racers, if I have your attention, speed is just one dimension that we're...